I wasn't expecting you home for lunch. Well, I hadn't planned it. My office computer went out again. Oh, it's not doing very well, is it? Batting zero. But since I'm here, I thought I might have a nice lunch with you. Oh, that's a shame. I'm sorry. Alistair and, already, and I already had plans to go out for lunch. Holly, I never see you anymore. You see me the same amount of time as usual. Yeah, but never alone. When's Alistair leaving? I told you, as soon as his package arrives. Well, we'll forward it on. Oh, I already tried telling him that, but he said he wants to wait. Awfully anxious about it, isn't he? Yes, he is. Makes me wonder what's in this wretched, mysterious package of his. You'll be leaving us soon, Alistair. Oh, uh, yes, unfortunately. Mm. We're waiting for a package, uh, she says. Yes, should be arriving any time. Uh, probably come with today's mail. Oh, uh, just what exactly is this? I can't tell you what it's meant to see my dear cousin again. Oh, we really enjoyed having you. I'm so glad you enjoyed it, too. Uh, now, about this sub... Uh, I hope I haven't imposed by having it sent here. Oh, no, not at all. It must be awfully important. Ah, uh, well, what is important? Air, food, kinship among family. Good mail service. I, uh, I do so dislike asking for favors. Especially after you've been so gracious, so hospitable. Oh, it's our pleasure. I hope you're not going to try and repay us. Pardon? I mean, it's package. You wouldn't try and embarrass us with some sort of a gift now, would you? Oh, nothing could repay such kindness. No? Well, you could tell me exactly what's... Uh... What I intend to do when I leave. Ah, uh, yes, well, heaven only knows. My heart speaks and my feet follow. <laughs> He's always been restless, on, haven't you? Oh, yes, that? that's me. Ever the wanderer. Yeah, I remember. There was a time in Kathmandu. Terrible mail service in Kathmandu. Oh, hideous. Mind you, it could be a bit dicey here, too. I mean, I hope there's nothing too valuable in this package. Oh, value is in the eye of the beholder. That's what I always say. You know, what to one man is a trifle, to another is a, a treasure. <laughs> Which is this? Uh, everything in life, to me, is a treasure. <laughs> yeah, wasn't it uh, Wordsworth who once said, um... Oh, no, was it Kipling? Ah, uh, lunch time. Hi, a splendid idea. That's too bad you can't join us, Robert. Yeah, downright shame. Ah, you work too hard, Robert. And so often with little result. But I never give up, though. No, though sometimes I wish you would. Hurry along now, Alison. Get out of here. Give me the number of the postmaster, please. Right, thank you. I'd like to speak to the postmaster. This is the police commissioner here. <clears throat> yes. Yeah, I'm expecting a package for an Alistair Crawford care of myself, Robert Scorpio. You wouldn't have received it yet, would you? Yeah, I'll hold. It's arrived? Good. Look, I'd like it to send over right away. Yeah. Thank you. Bye-bye. <clears throat> This is where we're having lunch? Yes, I picked it specially for you. For me? <laughs> Why? Because I know how much you like health food. Ah, true, dear cousin. However, a little gentle ambiance, pleasant service and delicate preparation are also good for the digestion. You'll find it here. Uh, perhaps, but think of the time we'll waste looking for it. You'll like it. Look, isn't the, uh, the Versailles room open for lunch? Yes, but I think it's time we tried something a little more simple. They certainly got the market on simple here. Why don't you sit down? This, uh, this just doesn't strike me as your sort of place, Holly. Well, 
Well, you'd be surprised, you know. Every now and then, the mood to slum it hits me. Sometimes it even lasts for days. And uh, I suppose you feel that mood coming on now, do you? Strongly. Just my luck. Uh, pardon? I said, uh, how's the duck? They don't serve meat here. Ah, no, I suppose they wouldn't. You know, uh, afternoon mail should be arriving pretty soon. Oh, really? Perhaps your parcel will arrive. Perhaps. Is it from a catalogue? What? What you ordered. It's a marvelous invention, catalogues, aren't they? Oh, miso soup. How delightful. I just hope it's the right size. What, the soup? What you ordered. Uh, was it clothes? No, I told you all mine are tailor-made. What are you getting? Uh, well, I'm not expecting anything. Not for lunch. Oh, I haven't decided yet. Uh, will, will it fit in your suitcase? Not my lunch? Uh, what's in your package? Oh, probably. It's not too heavy. No, I think I'll have something light. Your package? Yes. Expecting it any time now. Oh, waiter. Yeah, uh, might we have a little service? Yes. Our special today is um, avocado souffle. That's it. With walnut sauce. Oh, I don't know whether to feel sorry for the walnuts, the avocado, or your chef. <laughs> I'll have vegetable salad. Yes, sir. Same for me, too. Okay, you got it. Oh, I detest that phrase. Package for Alistair Crawford, chair of you, Commissioner. Oh. Sign here. Right. There. Thank yeah. you. up to something. <laughs> I've got you now, Alastair Crawford, Durban, Smith, Brown, whatever you what your name is. Idiot is a bloody thief. And they have no interest in prosecuting? Are you sure? Even if the culprit is caught? Huh. Well, how about you? Yeah, but isn't the company interested in getting him? I see. Uh -huh. No, if that's the way you feel, I mean, there's... There's no way I can force you to prosecute. Yeah. Yeah, I see. <laughs> mm. Robert, we're home. Oh, uh, listen, now, thanks for your help. Uh, right, today. Alistair, your uh, package has arrived. Oh, where is it? On the coffee table. Ah, here it is.
Aren't you going to open it? No rush. You don't seem very excited. Well, actually, I'm a bit saddened in a way. Oh, why's that? Well, now my package has arrived, I've no more excuses to stay. I'll, I'll be leaving very soon now. <laughs>